Today in the grain market, soybeans were firm. That basis has improved this week. Uh, futures did have a 12 cent range. We're right between 11.75 and 11.87 right now, uh, consolidating pretty much in the uh, same range that we've been in for about a week. We did add 3,200 to the call side. Um, certainly the fence there for the highest open interest on the calls versus puts is the 1260 strike on the calls, 1160 strike on the puts. So that's come in a little bit. There has been some migration of options to that uh, November contract. And that fence there is uh, $12 or $13 on the call side and $11 on the put side. And the open interest is pretty much the same uh, as the July right now. So there really is a, a big migration going on. Uh, the CVAL right now is at 19% with the soybean oil at 27.7 and the meal at 27.3%. Corn today was pretty steady, kind of trading on both sides of unchanged. The weather seems to be neutral, but the demand is good right now. We're really holding at that 450 area, yeah, even though the commitment of traders is just showing the uh, some of the money managers are adding to some of their uh, bearish positions, uh, but the market's still holding pretty strong right here. In the December contract, uh, there is some migration of those options there. That fence is at $5 on the high side, $4 on the low side, and we're right in the middle. So the market's kind of like uh, finding fair value right where we're at. C valve for corn is at 29.5%. Now, wheat today was a lower. That rainfall in the hard red wheat areas uh, uh, continuing to pressure the market. That that uh, futures continue to slide. We're down 11 days now, a dollar 10 from the high. We got down to 608 and a quarter. We did bounce off it a little bit, but clearly the market is oversold right now. But traders are just not ready to jump back into the market. So uh, you know, we'll see if uh, if as we get closer and closer to Wednesday, which is the USDA report, if maybe there could be a little bit of a shift in the market. Uh, certainly, in the option open interest is a big liquidation of 12,000 of the calls. Uh, for the July contract. But let's say in the September contract, we added 12,000. So clearly the, everyone's uh, already transferring to the next uh, future uh, contract. CVAL for the wheat is at 36.6%.